Morning data from a recent survey shows half of Americans have less than $500 in their savings account. This comes as experts say inflation is finally starting to come down. That means now is the best time to start saving some money. Channel 5's Naomi De Lucia has more. Mortgages, car payments, groceries and gas. Does it feel like expenses just keep piling up? I spend most of my money on surviving with food. My mortgage. <laughs> Groceries, utilities, fast food probably. Oh, oh, oh. According to a gold banking rate survey, 40% of people live paycheck to paycheck throughout the year. But are there some simple tricks to saving? Focus on your smaller bills, pay those off. If it seems almost impossible to keep any cash, here are a few simple tips. First, start a buck bank. Every dollar bill is marked with a letter to the left of George Washington. Save any bills with your initials on them. Save all $5 bills, no questions asked. Use tech to your advantage. Forbes calls Chime the best mobile banking app. Sign up for Save When You Spend and Chime will automatically round up purchases made with your Chime debit card and put the difference in your savings account. Capital combines money saving and goal setting. First, choose a goal like saving for a new car, then apply rules, such as every time you exercise, give your savings $5. If you exercise four times a week for a year, that adds up to more than $1,000. Even AI can help. Opportune Set and Save uses AI to analyze your spending habits. You put in special things you want, like concert tickets or a new outfit, and when it thinks you can afford it, it will move money from your checking account to the Opportune account for you to spend. Experts say the amount a person should have saved varies for each person. But in general, having an emergency fund of three to six months of living expenses in a saving account is a good idea. With ways to help you build a cash stash, I'm Naomi De Lucia with Channel 5 News.